only station that's been on the air. Uh, Kimberly Sakamoto has been watching the damage and listening to viewers' comments about it. Uh, we've been on from 3.30 until now straight. Kimberly, what's straight going on now? Well, I have been keeping an eye on your comments, on your pictures. Let's go ahead and take it full so you can get a better look of this. Right here, our photographer, Andy Shepard, took this out in the field in Oakland. Let's zoom in for it. That is actually an ABC7 van. And as you can see, with the soot on top of the hood of the car, that some explosive device just exploded on top of it. You can see all that soot just spread out. And when we zoom in a little bit further in, you can see that somebody tried to write something in there saying flashbang question mark. So we're not sure if it was a flashbang police device or if it was an illegal firework set off by rioters or protesters. The next picture we have for you, and again, it's an ABC7 van. I found this one on Twitter. Their reporter was actually in the van when the van was vandalized. You can see the windshield just completely smashed. And our next picture for you, also found on Twitter, this is the Sears building in Oakland. As we have reported before, the windows of that store were smashed. You can see people standing in front of there. And we're going to keep an eye on your comments. Go on to cron4.com where we do have a live blog. Participate and let us know what you're thinking about this verdict.